Hello friends, so far 4 videos has been uploaded in this series. Please check it out if you haven't seen them. Two videos are about your DevOps pipeline in detail and the third video is about how to create the steps template in Azure DevOps. And the fourth video is about how to create the jobs template in Azure DevOps pipeline. Let's continue our learning and learn how to create the template for different stages and how to use it. We will create the deployment stages for dev QA stage and production. We will also learn how to pass the parameter to stages template. So now the next step is to create the template for the stages. So let's say you are running the build stage and now you want to deploy the your piece of code on different environments like dev, QA stage and production. The process is same for the deployment only you have to pass the parameters that it will pick the dev environment variables or dev values and for QA it will use the QA variables and QA values and for the stage similarly stage variables and for production it will use the production. So, same stages but different parameters for, for that purpose we can create the, the template for stages so to create the template for stages let's go here and create a file here here stages hyphen template dot yum so in this i will add this piece of code so first keyword is stages and first stage is and for the stage name i am just passing the parameter which is the environment and same will be the display name and that we will use for the jobs so in that stages i have defined the job so one job is uh, i have defined and that job i am running the multiple scripts or multiple steps so first step is hello friends this is devops consultancy at solution the, uh, the environment name so name of the environment that i am passing so it will print here and similarly for the second uh, message i am uh, displaying this is demo project one for template hope you understand it right so i will commit it right so stages template has been written so now how to use into the main pipeline so in the main pipelines we already uh, using the resources loaded the resources so i'll just click here edit and add the stages so i will copy this template line and paste here under the stages so that template will be instead of jobs it will be stages so same stages template i'm using here yes, i will pass the parameter parameters and parameter i am using here is environment right so i will pass the give the value so it will be environment q or first dev and now i am running this template for the stage and pass the parameter dev for it right so let's make the changes so let's commit the changes and see how it works so let's go to the pipeline so pipeline must be running <clears throat> So now the build stage build is now there are two stages one is the build stage which we can see here this is the build stage and second stage is the dev stage uh, which is another stage its name is the environment parameter so parameter is dev so it will be the dev stage and this will run so now uh, there you can see there are two stages here so, so far the build stage is running so now you can see both the stages has been completed. So we'll go to the dev stage and see what are the messages. So here if I go on the line, so it is saying, hello friend, this is DevOps consultancy and solution DevOps dev environment. And similarly in the multi line script, you can see this is a demo, demo project one for template. Hope you understand it. And this is the message here. I'm using the variables dev. Uh, let's now add a couple of more stages and you can see understand how we can use the parameters. I'll just copy here these stages. So 
will be QA, this will be stage, and this stage will be production. So now we are using the same piece of code, which is a template, and reusing it for different environments or different stages. So let I commit this, and now we can see the stage for QA stage and production. Now we can go to the pipeline, and we can see uh yeah now we can see different stages has been added, and it will do the same purpose but with the different parameter values. So now all these stages have been completed. So if we go here, and I can show you in the dev, it is printing the message. The, this is DevOps CNS dev environment. And similarly for the QA, the message is this is dev CNS QA environment. Stage is the dev, DevOps CNS stage environment. And similarly for the production, the message will be this is DevOps CNS production environment. So now you have understood how to create the template for the stages and use it in the main pipeline. So in the same you can use into the multiple projects or the multiple YAML files. Hope this session would be useful for you. All template and main pipeline files have been created in GitHub repository. Link is mentioned here on the screen. I will also provide it into the description. Stay tuned and don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Keep learning, happy learning.